see if she's gonna be able to keep up with me today. I, I don't think she's, well, she probably gonna keep up, but she's gonna be wore out by the time. I'll be tired. See, right look like it has no weight though. neither, but I'm cutting across the park. And we're gonna go to Gatekeeper first. Yes, we're doing GP. Look at Val Raven holding up at the top. Oh man, I never get tired of this park. So Val Raven is the only thing open in front of the park right now. So I kind of got my hopes up. I wanted to rock Gatekeeper. Desk clothes, rappers clothes. Of course, you know, top three of the clothes. So we're gonna cut across here and check out Val Raven real quick. Hopefully that line is not crazy long. Hmm. So Blue Street down and Val Raven is down. It's still currently testing, but today is a Tuesday. It's like 11 o'clock, so I ain't gonna press me too hard. So I'm gonna head to the back of the park. Millennium Force is showing opening. So 15 minute wait for that. I'm gonna try that. See how luck go. But this thing right here though, top thrill, oh my god, look at that reverse, ooh, reverse spice. Ooh. That's crazy in person. Sitting in videos is different when you come see it in person. It's different. So um, she's about to get a little bit of a piece of history here. And I love saying so before I start talking. But so everything's pretty much closed besides Millennium. Millennium wait is showing like maybe 10 minutes. And so we're gonna hit this. It's gonna be pretty interesting in the before and after. You know, you know. Y'all see the sign, y'all see the sign. There's a lot of people haters though. A lot of haters. But let's go. I think she has to use the bathroom. Gotta to go to this outside toilet. Quit pulling on the door. Man, we gotta get in there. Go away. Alright, man. We, we, we will leave. You can't use it here. Dang it. Dang. Oh, these are some pretty little horses. You like Lemon Lou. It's a nickname. We about to go ride a real Maverick, though. <laughs> yeah, I am a Steel Avengers diehard guy, but for some reason today, I ain't ready yet. But Maverick is hyping me up. I ain't rode it since October, and it's just calling my name. They throwing these car trains out of here too. I just seen one pass today in block section, and another come down, but drop. So this week shouldn't be long, especially if it stands only 30 minutes. But dang, I'm ready to get on here. Frontier Town. That don't get you hyped, then I don't know what does. <laughs> Every drop isn't that high, of course. People who rode this knows, and um, but the launches and just the way the overall ride is designed is just freaking. I'm gonna say perfect. Like this is a 10 out of 10 ride for me. Like everything is perfect on it. But with that being said, she's seen the height of it and just trying to let her know the size doesn't matter. So <laughs> we're just gonna let her know see when she get off of this thing. The size doesn't matter. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and if you ain't, this restaurant right here is money. That's the country restaurant I was telling you about. Food in there is so good. It's great. really really great man those forces on there also and then launches man let me tell you this ride never gets old no matter how many times i ride it the wait always long for a reason definitely a yeah he's talking junk to me the bat but you know yeah they were wanting to jump in my video but yeah maverick hits and slaps man them launches whoo course screws man those downs are money Get my life together before I say Maverick better than still Vengeance. Just kidding. Let's go get on Vengeance. 
y'all can see this and out, but I get chill bumps. Every time I come to Steel Vengeance, it never fails. That should tell you something. I'll tell you it's the best ride in the world. But I have ridden anyways. So. <laughs> Time to da So we just got off Steel Vengeance. And um, what do you think about that? I loved it. That was probably one of my favorite ones that we've ridden on. I loved how long it was. Like you felt like it was gonna be, like it should be done. And then it just kept on going. So, I love the airtime. It was the airtime. Yeah. And it was pretty good. And for me, as always, this is my number one ride that all the parks I've been to, nothing comes close to this. Um, every time I ride it, it reminds me why this is my number one coaster. Because the airtime on is unreal. I'm way out of my seat, more than in planet in my seat, and I love airtime. And this ride really just, it does it for me. It's top tier. Nothing can touch it. It's in their own level of its own. I don't need a tan I just need a good Slamming airtime muscle, that's all I need. But dang, this ride is good. See the creek mine. Oh man, she exploded exfoliating her face. Sunblock. Whatever you want to call it. We're about, we're about to go to the mine train ride. If you guys don't know, this is a fantastic ride. Right here. One and only. Look at the cobwebs on it. Look at those cobwebs. I don't know if I can up, but it be money. But I cannot wait to get on the mine train. Oh also that wild mouse. The wild mouse here be hitting it. But that's off topic though. But we gotta get on this. Cedar Creek Mine Ride. We gotta get all the credits anyways. Well she does, I already wrote it. And it's only a five minute wait today. Everything else closed anyway, so might as well. <laughs> hey, that's it. Look at all this wonderful structure of wood out here. Oh, she's going to do this. <laughs> to be continued. <laughs> so, yeah. That, like, that was terrorizing. The mine ride. You see the point? It was terrorizing. The helix. <sighs> the helix on there. When it kept spinning and spinning. And then spinning. <laughs> and it's like all spinning. Then I like came back into the station. That part. That's all I look. That's all I'm gonna say. Be in. Yeah. That part right there. I was actually supposed to be in the video. Next on the list is Gemini. We should definitely ride in different trains and see who wins. Today's on a five minute wait. Magnum is down, not Magnum. <laughs> Gemini is down in the lift hill. So we about to hit that magic seat. Um, you know, call one, row three. If you know about it, you need to get about it. And I can't wait to see her reaction when we get off call one, row three. Eject her. All right, so I just got Magnum. That magic seat was hit. All right, don't care what none of y'all, some of my um, non enthusiastic friends are scared of a little pain, but that, that ejector, this nasty ejector, she was hitting money. And as soon as we got off. So she want to go back on. I do. Oh man. Well, we going back on again. I'm gonna tell you the back row. <laughs> but so while I'm here, I can't help but stop looking at this it's not open. I really based my trip off of this ride. But I take the good with the bad. Top thrill two. Hmm. 
look at look at those stats and stuff right there. More like most disappointing thrill too. <laughs> Shit's still down. Per usual. This ride is cursed. I'm a firm believer of that. This is all me right here. Wild mouse, this is what we're going to. This is my hoodie, wild mouse. So I bought it this is the wildest wild mouse she ever ridden. Okay. She's saying okay like she don't know. Let's do it. I can't wait to go on the wild mouse. Look at those skins. Oh, it's awesome. Look at that. Hey, 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 hey. Ready to go and walk on some sunshine and get on this wild mouse and this is gonna make my day. So, at every park I go to, I'm definitely hitting the wild mouse. The wild mouse is like my go-to. If you know me personally, you know I'm not lying. And I make everybody who with me, ride them with me. I don't care if they like it or dislike it. We getting on that. Oh, you ain't coming with me no more. Deep, 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 deep. I've been struggling to get some credit today because of the ride downtown today. And I come over here to Iron Dragon. It's a little bit of five minute wait, which is really good. It's like not this off my list today. And she never had a rating of suspended coaster. Oh, here she goes. So yeah, the ride sways underneath the track pretty much all the turns is what makes it fun. Low elements. Those turns are pretty fun too over there. But once again, it's a verse spike though. Still upset that I can't get ride top thrill too. I wrote the original, but I really want to ride the new version. <laughs> but let's get in this line and get up to the ride. Have a good time. We just got off the Iron Dragon. I'm gonna feel like GP say the Iron Dragon. How was that? It was good. Uh, it was good. It's not fair. Why? Because it's not fair. Why? She getting all kind of credits that it took me forever to get. It's not fair. <laughs> That's a very rare credit too. It's a suspended swinging coaster now. It's a very rare and hard to find. I think it was pretty good. Oh, it was pretty good, huh? Yeah. About to go to Rugeru. I really hate this ride. I really hate to try. There's no like to it, but I'm still gonna ride it. Risky things. Yeah. Just to make sure that you don't drop it. So this actually used to be a stand-up coaster, and they changed it. So the coolest coaster. I didn't get to experience the actual older ride. The only thing I ridden is the coolest one with turn. Definitely not one of my favorites. Once again, head bang too much. But I ain't backing out. Lights, camera, action. Something smooth. Brick moment back. Yeah. So, did you like Rougarou? Yeah, it was good. I liked um, all of the helixes. Oh my gosh. Is that the right loops. word? Loops. Inversions. Alright, I like all the loops. Oh my gosh. However, it did hurt my ears a little bit. When it was banging my head around. What hurt her ears was that great roar from b and Magnificent sound that they create. Just kidding. The hair restraints hurt like hell. But it's still a fun ride. But for like three hours of the park, it's time for power three hours. Lines are getting short. So we're about to hit a miracle run and try to get some new re-rides. Get the new credits tomorrow. Today has got away from me and kind of shot by pretty fast. I've been marathoning a few rides and still vengeance had got down to like maybe a 15 minute wait. And at the end of the day, that thing is hauling boogie. Hauling boogie. So, saw that Val Raven is only like 15 minute wait. Hopefully we can hit that. Because, got some credits to get. Not for me, but for her. <laughs> trying to get them all. <laughs> that sounds like Pokemon. I'm trying to get them all. Yeah. Gotta catch them all. <sighs> but let's go get this credit.
I think I'm ready. You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Let's do it. She, she says she's ready. So we're going to see if her arms are ready. So her arms are going to be spaghetti. <laughs> Before I get on, of course, some of these records have been broken, but some of the stats. at the end of the day and I think it paid off. That was in 15 minutes but really it's walk on city baby. Today's been so good, like really good. But I'm gonna put y'all away so I can get on. <laughs> so how was your ride on Val Ray Vaughn? That was pretty fantastic actually. Pretty fantastic. Yeah I liked it. Um, I was like I felt like I was hanging out in my seat for a second there which was kind of cool. Oh and the little roly turny thing huh? Mm -hmm, I'm yeah. good to oh. so, I like that part. Hmm I like that part. Mm -hmm. hmm. I also like that we didn't have to wait. Wow, yeah, we didn't really wait at all. It was a straight walk on up the stairs. Um, I'm gonna try to hit the rest of the credits in here though once again because I saw Raptors running also. But Val Raven was really, really great. Um, there was a little key to that aspect of the ride for me. It made it a little bit more crazy or intense because it's so fucking, excuse me, it's so fudging windy today. Like when you got at the top of the lift hill, you can feel it shaking a little bit. It's like, ugh. And even on the brake run, you still can feel it shaking a little bit, which, he just added to the ride for me. So, I think we're about to try to hit Blue Street while you're up towards the front now. So tomorrow we'll be kind of chill and not rush. Hunter is going to surprise you a little bit, I believe. Yeah. There's no line in here either. I'm going to need to pick this thing on overdrive. Overdrive, overload, enjoy my last hour of the park. Literally, the park is dead. I say dead. There she goes. Finally running. It's been down pretty much all day long. I'm going to get the last ride of the day. Are you ready, spaghetti? Yes. I love it. You are? Yeah. Oh, man. That's good to say. Yep, 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 yep. Hold up. Hey. Hello. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Just a little excited. You know what I'm saying? Excited. You're excited? Yeah. Yeah. There's no line either. This is pretty awesome. But all right. Let's go. How'd you like those keyholes? It was great. I loved it. It was so smooth. It was so smooth. Yeah. Yeah. Love that. You're talking about those keyholes on Gatekeeper. You are going up again? But, uh, yeah. I love Gatekeeper. One of my favorite wing coasters. Besides Thunderbird at Holiday World, which I will be going there in a few days. It's a launch wing coaster. FYI, that thing is money. But, overall, I had a great day in the park. A little tired. I'm about to head out the gate because the park closed at 8 and it's like 15 minutes. And I'm going to try to beat some people out of here and try to give me some food. And I'm going to try to hit this back again tomorrow. I'm not sure if I'm bringing this camera along though. Because today was the day. Tomorrow I need my day. You know what I'm saying? But I'm out. Peace.